Today is just a pretty chill day. It's snowing. It's. Yeah, it's just cold and snowing. So, but I just wanted to come on here because today is going to be the first, my first vlog in the new year. So, I just wanted to kind of go over how I am going about like changing how I want my life to be going about in the new year and stuff like that so you got to see a little bit i usually will wake up and i journal and i plan which is what i do but the biggest thing that i've been working on is before you guys know how i like would wake up like ridiculously early like essentially even before my body was ready to go and do my thing and then i was like exhausted the entire day so this year my goal is to wake up, like if my alarm goes off at six and I am like not feeling well rested, I will go back to sleep and I try again the next hour. And the idea is that I'm letting my body tell me when it's ready to wake up. So that happened. So today I woke up at eight, started journaling around nine. I like to spend a little bit of time in bed with Max, he's right. He's right there. So cute. So I just wanted to, I just wanted to come on here and give you guys a heads up on that. Um, I'm going to be going into town in a little bit. I need to pick up oat milk. I need to, what else do I need to do? Pick up oat milk. I want to look at some stuff so I can finish the bathroom because we're getting some really beautiful shelves in today. I need to email, do some emails. I need to put up a TikTok edit a YouTube video. I'm trying to do a, um, my week, like getting ready with me my first week at the gym, but it's, I'm doing it the first week and already come tomorrow, all of our gyms are shutting down again. So that's a bit irritating, but I'm going to try and keep on with that video. Just trying to like show you how, even if the gyms are closed, how I'm going to be staying physically active but um, we shall see how that goes. But yeah, I am going to, I can give you guys a quick OOTD as well because this is my outfit, I love. Leggings are just my Lululemon Wonder Unders, love them. My Gymshark um, Whitney Simmons uh, like tank top. And then this, just this sheen waffle print, like sage green cardigan. I love it, it's so comfy. But with that being said, I'm going to go and do those things and then maybe take this guy to the, for a little walk or something, but we'll see, see that as well. But I'm going to go and do all of the work things first and then I will see you guys whenever I try to do something different. Okay guys, so I'm currently making chicken breasts and I got back from the store. I just picked up some silk oat milk for my coffees because I'm trying to reduce my dairy intake as much as possible. So that's where a lot of it comes from. So I'm having a little bit of that with a splash creamer. That way it's less, you know what I mean? So I'm just making up a little decaf coffee because I already had a coffee coffee this morning. So this way I'm not bouncing up the walls. And then I'm also, like I said, I'm just making a chicken breast in the air fryer and then I also got just some goldfish which is my favorite but sorry I didn't take you with me I kind of left my phone here so it's yeah but just having a little espresso shot with that decaf 
I'm going to finish up cooking and I will see you later. Okay guys, I am getting ready to go and do a chest, chest, triceps, and shoulders workout. But I need to change because I'm wearing the same outfit that I was wearing before. But this is day two of my week going to the gym. Okay guys, so I just got back from the gym. Gavin and I had some supper, but my Amazon package has come in and the shelves are looking so cute. I absolutely love them. I'm just so excited to get these up and done, but I'm gonna show you quick what they look like. Hi. Yes. And I like this wood and they look really cute. And this, they're going to go right, right here. And then another one is gonna go right here above the toilet. But I don't know which one's going where yet because there's also it also comes with a hook or a rod that I can put hooks for towels. So I think I'm gonna do that one either over the toilet or over here. I'm not quite sure yet, but I will keep you posted. Okay, so this is a finished product <laughs> we just have this one set up for candles and the speaker and then this one i just put my stuff on so then they can have the drawer back and then towel speaker okay guys i'm not sure if you can hear me right now because i am currently trying to have a shower but um I just wanted to show you guys what I usually will use when I go to have a shower. And as well, oh gosh, sorry, I'm kneeling. <laughs> when I get in the shower again, I will also moisturize using the Bondi Sand Everyday Gradual Tanning Milk. I really like this. It doesn't make me orange, which I really like. Um, and then I will show you the lineup for what's in the shower too. Okay, so when I'm in the shower, I've been using the Monday shampoo. I'm currently just trying to get rid of it at the point. At this point, I don't really love it. It's not my favorite. I find that my hair isn't the biggest fan of it, but I have that. I use, um, I have a little Harry's razor. I love them. A Summer's Eve, some Aveeno Stress Relief Body Wash, Bath and Body Works, Body Wash, and then the other Monday. But basically, so that's about it that I use when I shower. The other thing I use is one of these hair wraps, which I love. I really enjoy those. Oh, and I also use the Shea Moisture 100% Virgin Coconut Oil Leave-In Conditioner as well. I also use that when I get out of the shower as well just to make sure my hair is super nice and hydrated. Shower, I'll end the video now, just because that way I've done it. But I just wanted to say I love you guys so, so, so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Please feel free to subscribe and leave a comment. You know I love to see all you guys' comments, and I will see you next week. It for you, since you came.